Well, how's it going guys? Welcome back to another exciting ice fishing video. Today is Thanksgiving and I was able to sneak away for a few hours to do some fishing. So I am thankful for that. But I've come to this lake right here. And as you can see, it is totally covered in ice. And I was actually here a couple weeks ago and I broke some holes in the ice to do some fly fishing right here. So I know for a fact, right below my feet, there should be a bunch of brook trout. So today we're gonna try to catch them through the ice. I'm gonna chop some holes and I'm gonna try to get a little bit of underwater footage. Hopefully it works out. Underwater footage is harder to get than you'd think, but we're gonna try. So we're gonna chop some holes, hopefully catch some fish. How's it go? All right. See, uh, like I said, a couple weeks ago, I was sitting on that log right here and I caught a bunch of brook trout just right here. So we're gonna chop a hole, see how thick this ice is. Just cracked. Okay, so the ice is fairly thick, but it's also kind of soft. But we're working with probably three and a half inches. So if there's any fish down there, we should be able to see them. So far, I'm not seeing any. Let's go ahead and try right here. So we're probably in like three, three and a half feet of water and I can't see anything yet. I'm gonna drop a jig down there and just see if anything comes up to it. We've got some night crawlers today. There we go. All right, we'll drop her down. Oh, there's that, there's a fish. There's a tiny little four incher down there. Came right up to it. Oh, he's got it. Got him. Oh, missed him. It was just a little guy. Oh, he grabbed it again. He grabbed it again. Got him that time. Got him that time. There we go. I haven't seen too many, but there's a few. And this is just a little guy. I missed him the first time and he came back for it. Pretty little brook trout. Super pretty. Look at those colors. Holy cow. See you later, buddy. Got him. Got him. <laughs> Another little guy. Look at that. So I chopped a hole a lot closer to shore here and on the drop, three came out for us. So they might be hugging the shore. Wow, that is just so cool. Look at those colors. Man, there's not a whole lot of big fish in this lake. So probably gonna catch a handful of these. Thank you. I did see at least two others. Oh, oh, there he is. Dude, that's a nice one. There's a bunch down there. Okay, hold on folks. Before I drop down anymore, I'm gonna chop another hole and I'm gonna set my underwater camera down. All right, so if you watched the last underwater footage video I did, you'll know that my method is pretty simple. Just clamp my GoPro to a stick and then just drop it down there and hope and pray that it doesn't die immediately. A lot of times in this cold water, it can just die either in two seconds or 20 minutes. So I'm gonna drop her down there. Hope it's facing the right direction. And hopefully I didn't spook the fish either. Oh, there he is, there's one, there's one. Can you guys see him? Oh, oh, one grabbed it, one grabbed it. Come on, got him, got him, got him. <laughs> nice, that's a little bit bigger one. Hopefully I got that on camera. That's not a bad one. Still not very big, but this is about the average size you're gonna get out of here. And we'll send him back. Thank you. Let's try that again. Drop it back down. There was a few down there, I think. Yeah, there's another one, there's another one. Can you guys see him? Oh, <laughs> he just crushed it. Come on. He's got it, got him, got him. Ooh, that one's a little bit bigger. I think they're just right at the end of their spawn. So they're starting to lose some of their color, but that one is just gorgeous. Look at that. Wow. Look at that guy. He's got kind of a little scar on the top of his head. That's interesting. See you later. All right, can we get a third one right here? Hmm. Oh, there's one, there's one. He's got it, he's got it. Oh, missed him again. Oh, he grabbed it. He wants it. Oh, shoot. He just took my worm. Come back, buddy. Got a fresh worm for you. Oh, there he is, there he is. Dude, how am I missing him? He got it, got him. I don't think that's the same one. That other one was a little bit bigger. Yeah, and this one's a female. 
she feels pretty fat. I don't know if she's already laid her eggs or not, but she's kind of thick. So just in case she hasn't spawned yet, we're gonna get her back nice and quick, nice and gentle. You don't want to squeeze them. Look at that, she took my worm too. We'll let her have it. See you later, girl. Golly, this is so much fun, man. When you can just sight fish these little brook trout right below your feet. That's one of my favorite things to do. Open water and ice fishing is just sight fishing. I don't think it gets more fun than that. It just gets you, gets you excited. There's only a couple things in this world that get me that excited. Just missed one. One is fishing. You can probably guess the other one. <laughs> Grab a quick picture of this guy. By the way, if you guys want to follow my Instagram, I don't particularly love using it. If you want to follow me down there, sometimes I post pictures. I'll leave it linked in the description. Drop her back down. I just saw a nice one cruising around down there. Come on. I think a lot of these fish are just hugged up close to the cover right on shore. And then every once in a while, they'll just kind of circle back. And that's when I'm getting them. Oh, there's a nice one. There's a nice one. Hey, hey, turn around. A nice one just came in. There he, oh man, this little guy interrupted my business. Dude, there was a nice one next to this guy. Of course, this little guy just had to come in, and mess it all up. Golly, they're so cute though. They are so cute. See ya. Oh, there's one. Got him, got him, got him. Ooh, that one's really pretty. Calm down, buddy, calm down. Look at that one, that one's got super dark colors. See ya. Oh, there's one. Crushed it. Crushed it. Nice. And just look at that guy. Probably can't see because the glare is kind of bad, but I don't even know how many we've caught. Probably a lot by now. And I'm really hoping that I'm getting some good underwater shots. Can't believe I'm still getting bit with this. Like, I just barely got a piece of chewed up worm on this jig head still coming in hot and smoking it got him another one heck i could probably catch these guys on just a bare hook oh there he goes quick catch and release all right so i chopped a hole a little bit closer to shore and if you guys can see that right there that's open water and i can actually see fish right there in the open water uh it's a little shallower right here probably a foot and a half but it seems like these fish aren't going to be too deep anyway so Oh, got him, got him. That's the nicest one, that's the nicest one. Check that out. <sighs> Hope I got that on camera. That's a stud, brook trout. Oh yeah, that's definitely the biggest one of the day, for sure. Came out and smoked it. All right, we'll let this guy go. Biggest one of the day. <sighs> See you later. Oh, there's one, there's one. Did he got it? He's got it. There we go. That guy came up. That guy ate it right in front of the camera too. Just little guys, but they're fun. We'll just toss them back here. See you later. All right, so I moved away from that first spot and I've come over here where another little spring comes in and I've already chopped a few holes and there are a lot of fish down there. Hopefully they're still down there. There's one, there's one, got him. On the drop, dude, I saw like three. That is insane. This was one of the smaller ones too. Golly, these fish are so strong. It's crazy. Nice, just send him back. See you later. Oh, there's one, that's a nice one, that's a nice one. Oh, dang, a nice one just came up to it. I think I spooked him because they can probably see me through this hole. I chopped a pretty big hole so I could see better. Oh, he's got it. Oh, shoot, I wasn't paying attention. And then a big old brookie just latched onto it. Shoot. Golly. Oh, 
There's one. Oh, he's got it. Got him. Got him. That's a nice one. Oh, and get over here, buddy. Get over here. Come here. Come here. There he goes. Quick catch and release. All right, guys. Well, that's going to do it for today's video. Hope you enjoyed. Super fun time out here once again, catching a bunch of brookies through the ice and getting some sweet underwater footage. Hope you guys enjoyed that. It is just a beautiful day. I, I haven't mentioned that, but I mean, it is just so calm and peaceful out here. It's almost eerie how quiet it is. I mean, it's just so still. You could hear a pin drop. And we better enjoy it now because we got some really bad snowstorms coming here in the next couple days. Super fun time. Glad I could get out here on Thanksgiving. But if you guys enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. I would really appreciate it. But other than that, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Thank you.